In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get mints to change the natures of your Pokemon and other materials that you can get from farming. Now, you may have already noticed that you have a farm in Jubilife Village that can have up to four different farming plots that give you rare items. The farm is located here in Jubilife Village. Now, to actually make use of the farm, you're going to be speaking to this dude over here, who you'll actually be doing several requests for to increase the space of your farm and also unlock extra things that you can actually farm. So here, I actually collected a harvest of mints, but there are many more things you can get. And obviously, mints is more of a late game thing, but there are also options like the apricorns, medicinal stuff, vegetables, mushroom, berry harvest, and then the mint harvest, each one getting more expensive than the last. The mint harvest is 10,000 Poké Dollars. And is currently, I think, the only way to get mints in the game, though I'm not too sure. It's just the only consistent way that I've been getting mints to make my Pokemon perfect for, for what I want their stats to be. During the requests, you will first need a ground-type Pokemon to unlock the first plot over here. To unlock the next plot, you're going to need a water-type Pokemon. And for the final farming plot here, you're going to need a Pokemon that knows the move Rock Smash. If at any point you want to swap these Pokemon out, either for maybe like giant alpha Pokemon so that they make your village look really cool, you are able to just speak with the Pokemon and swap them out with a Pokemon that fits that same criteria. Like for this one, I just needed another Pokemon that knows Rock Smash. And then after some time, after visiting different areas of the map and after different in-game days, pause, you'll be able to come here and collect your harvest. And when you get your harvest, you'll get those mints, for example. And when you want to use the mints, you just go to your satchel. This is a call mint. It will increase my special defense, but lower my attack, essentially, for whichever Pokemon I apply it to. So you want to use some of these that really benefit certain Pokemon, like a Pokemon who either requires more speed or maybe more attack or more, more special attack. For example, Rhyperia uses attack, so I would use a mint that increases his attack but decreases his special attack since I don't use special attack just to make him a lot more stronger. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching.